Uh, okay, I thought I refreshed smart balls. Oh, yeah, smart balls fell really far behind for me. Yeah, yeah, it's still coming, but. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, smart balls just having a little. Yeah, okay, so it's almost started on my end. So. Yeah, it's funny, his stream says it's really close in delay, but it's really far behind in terms of gameplay. Yeah, but, so, yeah, this is just why to maybe try to do some swag here. Not even a, a spin jump off the Koopas from Roblox End. Uh, let's see. Oh, nice, smart ball with some swag. Oh, it's always cool to see. Mm. Swag here. Uh, so Roblox with the 360. So it's possible to get a 361 here. Like with the speed oscillation, if that works out correctly, you have a 20% chance of getting a three, 361 on this. So let's see how Smart Ball can do. Oh, okay, he's not even going for it. It's yeah. not really worth it. It's like yeah. it's only one, like one frame different, one yeah. or two frames difference. Yeah, it's only you're only going to save time in World One with it if you go for shell jump. Okay, so it looks like Rogue Link's just doing like the non-box jump chat. That can be hard, like when you're when you're new to new to the game. So I imagine Smart Ball's going to go for it. Yeah. Okay, and gets it. So that's that's really the most worrying part of Y3. Hmm. Okay. I'm gonna try to refresh my boss stream. Let's see. Hmm. Okay. So it may look like small boss behind, but that's just from from that. So let's see, so yeah, small boss definitely looks... ahead, but the restream makes it look like he's behind. Yeah. So smart off the 259. So basically, just like if you're on the platforms for like the brown platforms for the most amount of time, yeah, push you forward and you can get a 259. Oh, whoa, Rolink. Okay. <laughs> a little troll there. Oh no! Didn't you see the Author Blues MS Paint image? Hmm. Okay, still got through that. And Smart Ball are getting through that too. And no, sh I guess, I don't think it was Shell Jump for Rogue Link and Smart Ball, I guess, no. didn't, either didn't get it or didn't go for it. <laughs> yeah. So, okay. Iggy's, that's something I sometimes kind of find a little bit challenging, like if you wanted it optimally. So, ooh, Rogue Link, we're near death. So, I guess ultimately you'll get a 281 here. Yeah. So, none. Okay, 280. That's 280 still pretty good. And 279 as a newer player definitely is reasonable. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, we'll have to see how they choose to keep their fire flower for the next world here. Mm -hmm. Looks like they're both going for it in the castle here, so we'll have to see what they yeah. do later. Okay, yeah. So I think uh, that's a, like a 313 or so on Smart Ball's hand, and yeah. I didn't see what Rogue Link got. Yeah, we had the gameplay is synced, but definitely not time wise. Yeah. My stream. It's like really synced. Well. I almost don't want to refresh just because of how perfect it looks. <laughs> yeah. Also, good note, Smart Ball is on the Japanese version and Rogue Link is on the American version. Uh, which throughout this run, say, if you're on Japanese version, I believe it says like something like 2.3 seconds, which obviously isn't really much of a deal, but you never know. If you ever had a close race, it could, could come down to something like that. I have seen close races in this category like that. Yeah. So, okay, DP1, the first somewhat kind of challenging level. Okay, Rogue Link kind of... Was in P speed there, uh, but yeah, it can be tough to do this level at first. Oh, Smart Ball having a good DP, DP one. Oh, Rogue Link losing Fire Flower. That's not the biggest deal though. Okay, three sixty from yeah, Smart Ball. That was very optimal there. Yeah. And s still, this is still pretty good for like a, a newer player. Like a three forty six isn't isn't bad. Your player. 
We'll have to see how, it, how uh, Smart Ball decides to keep his fire here, and Rogue Link does not have his, but we'll see if he decides to go small here. Uh, yeah. Oh, Smart Whoa. Ball, go and not that scared me. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Usually I just say people go through that if they have the flower and just fireball the fish. Yeah. Uh, it looks like he is not going for the uh, deep boost. So we'll have to see what he does in DP3. Yeah, I prefer generally. I actually prefer generally have, having fire there, but if you wanted the optimal strat, I don't usually go for the most optimal strat, so eh. Yeah. <laughs> mm. yeah, most people I've seen so far go small because it's a little more consistent in certain places, but definitely it's just more based on preference. Yeah. Also, considering so, he went under world. the level there, getting a 240 is pretty decent considering he bonked there when he tried to go under the level. Okay, pretty good. D DP or DGH from, from Smart Ball. Ooh, but the doors trolled them both. <laughs> <laughs> okay, see? Ah, uh, that boo isn't moving. Boo. Yeah. That can be kind of hard to like figure out what to do at first, but basically yeah. you just want to spin jump twice on the staircase, and then after you spin jump again, it should always work. You didn't want to be to the left of the bay. All right, let's see how the infamous DP3 goes here for Smart Ball. <laughs> Ooh, looks oh, like he jumps a little too early there. Yeah, that can be, yeah. Uh, yeah, so that's that probably would... the part that throws me off the most there, is those jumps can be a little precise. Yeah. But now he looks like he's just gonna go smaller, which could definitely give him an advantage. Ooh, dies to the Koopa. Oh, it's my gift. My gift, Rogue Link, and tries to catch up. Oh, he, d he does too. Mm. Yeah, Rogue Link definitely could have caught up there. Even if he played it casually, he would have gained a little, probably. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Smart Ball okay, does get through this first half. Let's just see if he can get some of these jumps. Definitely the second half is easier, for sure. So, as long as he can get these few jumps, he should be A-okay. Yeah. And he gets it. 62 yeah, okay. as well. Very nice. Yeah, nice. So, I guess it's worth noting, it may look like it was really close at first, but, like, Smart Ball is actually more head than what it looks like on the splits. Like, yeah, his yeah, stream is a little like delayed. Oh, yeah. yeah, so Rogue Link just kind of isn't thinking it's safe here. Can't blame him. Oh, losing. That. And I'm assuming so Smart Ball here will go for the roulette oh. block. And that was a very nice bounce off the hammer room. Yeah, that can be. That can be. That can be kind of tricky. The, like the jump from the green pipe. Yep, he does okay, go for the roulette. I was assuming you okay. would. Okay, not getting the cape, that's good. <laughs> Right. Oh, losing Yoshi. All right. So, luckily, that's not going to affect him. If he got hit slightly later, that could have thrown it off. But luckily, he did it early enough that it didn't really throw off his movement. Oh, nice. Nice green pipe jump from our Link. Yeah, both of them did very well with that. It's going to be tricky. So getting his new runner's good. Oh, and looks like he's going for star strats. Like, he want to fire for the next part, but... For Morton, but still, it's generally the safe way to do it. Ubi's it not scrolling the screen, that could. Okay, but if you're. Yeah, it's all yeah, you if can you, just do yeah. that. So, when Morton's here, since you don't have a cape to do the fly, generally you're just gonna wait a little here. But you still do, do go for half a cycle skip. That looks really yeah, sketchy. Yeah. I don't even know. Yeah. Um, that jump there. Um, yeah. So yeah, you'll see he bounces off the dry bones, and he's gonna try to skip half a cycle here at the very end. Yeah. And as long as you get maneuver through here fast enough, you will be able to get it. Sadly, uh, it's really tight though, so if you make one wrong move, it could throw you off a bit. Yeah, and like if you mess up a lot, the springboard may not even save time because because like the cycle there is a little more tight when you don't have cape. For sure, definitely cape is easier in terms of saving the cycle. Yeah. So it's like smart goal gets a 925 whistle and we'll have to see what Rogue yeah. Link gets here. He's just yeah. playing it casually, which I don't blame. Yeah. 
Yeah, like even for better runners, like it's it's pretty easy to like make a mistake there and like lose a cycle or even two. Oh yeah, for sure. I've done uh, it. Yeah, me too. So. Let's see, actually, let me see if I can catch up some full screen. So. So let's see. So it looks like Roland's actually 41 seconds ahead of his PB. Yeah. So it's pretty high. 20, not bad. Yeah. <laughs> Smart ball going for the blue shell here. And yeah. I'm assuming most of the most runners I've seen just go for the stomp strat here to get rid of it. No, yeah. just gonna throw it back. Luckily, it does, it's not really that much of a difference. It's just interesting yeah. to see what people prefer to do. Yeah. Yeah, in this level, you with Yoshi, you're gonna actually end up ditching him here. If you have enough yeah. speed going up that block there and jumping off of it, you will. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> nice. <laughs> You'll basic. You basically. It's basically faster just to ditch him instead of going through the vines there. And as Dude. as you can see, if you do not act. Fa fast enough, you can get really close to those Koopas, and we've seen people lose a few Fire Flowers to those Koopas in, this, in these races. And also, the Green Bean, like, it, they can, like, not spawn, but luckily, luckily Smart Ball handled it well. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. And if you scroll the screen high enough, usually you don't have an issue with uh, despawning. Alright. I've seen some newer runners who get thrown off and don't like to do the Yoshi Ditch and, uh, VS1, so we'll have to see if... Looks like Rogue League will Ooh. still be doing it, though. Oh, Ooh. nice. First section by, by Smart Ball. Ah, oh, he missed. Uh, Rogue League missed yeah, that. he's going a little too early on that. He has enough speed. He's just, he just went a little too early on that. Ah. Uh. Oh, looks like he's just going to wait it out here with the Koopas. Yeah. Should be a little scary. <laughs> 15 bucks. 15! Looks like they both have a little collection now. <laughs> All right, so in Vanilla Secret 3 here, you're generally going to be good as long as you know how the dolphins work and how their patterns generally go. So every cycle is basically the same besides, I believe it's the third cycle that is slightly different every time. But as long as you know how the dolphins work, you generally should not get thrown off that much. <laughs> looks like Smart oh. Ball gets some interesting pea speed off the fish down there, and it looks like he's just going to slowly yeah. try to take it throughout the rest of this. Yeah, at least he did. I was worried that he was going to lose the Yoshi there. That would have been to, pretty bad. Tries to give Yoshi some food, but nope. Yeah. We'll see if Rogue Link can give us... Oh, actually, he's on the American version, so he can't do that. Yeah. So, okay, so Smart Ball entering, entering Vanilla Forts, like, this is, it's generally not that stressful level until Resnor, but it's like, you just generally swim through most of it, but I guess it may get a bit tricky. Ooh. That's, ah, that's gonna lose some time later. I said it was easy, commentator's curse. <laughs> uh. Yeah, sadly, that's gonna end up losing him 15 seconds later in the Ludwig fight. Yeah, yeah. Mm. As long as he can keep some type of power up in his Yoshi for Butterbridge 2, he should be in A-OK -okay shape in the meantime. Yeah. Okay, so let's see. Oh, Roguelink having a pretty good VS3. Wow, that was actually really, considering he's a newer player, that's actually probably one of the most, like, optimized levels he's done so far. That was really good. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Time for everyone's favorite level. <laughs> so right now they're about a stage, stage apart, I would say. And and change because I think Smart Ball probably I think he's still like a little delayed. Yeah, he's like fifteen seconds delayed on my end. Yeah. <sighs> See, Smart Ball's having a little fun with his Yoshi there. Yeah. Uh. 
And I'll have to see if Rogue Link can keep his Fire Flowers, because he can definitely gain in a little small time if he can keep at least one flower to that Ludwig fight. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and he has a backup one, too, so he's Whoa. pretty comfortable right now. And also, he's a little scared. <laughs> Rumble was letting that platform go pretty low. Let's see if Smart Ball does some extra last strats. Just get that one up. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. So you Whoa, Resnor. Really Whoa. Whoa. Resnor not being kind. Oh! Ooh. No. Looks like he will not be having a Fire Flower. No. He does uh, still have a Yoshi, that's... though. If he can keep that, he should be okay for Butterbird 2 ahead of here. Yeah. Because I don't expect any newer player to know the no Yoshi strat. Yeah. Hmm. So, uh, Small Ball doesn't have, like, Ooh. a shell. Ooh. Ooh. What? Small oh. Ball. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Rose okay. my heart rate just a little there. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Really swagging out there. Yeah. I haven't seen somebody be that confident with Swag. Yeah. You Rogue Link small again. It'd be a yeah. really scary and intimidating when you're around the Resnors. But yeah, we'll have to see. Well, since uh, Smartball has a Yoshi for Butterbridge 2, as long as he does everything just right, he should be able to just grab the Blue Shell around the midway point. Yeah. The Blue Shell grab can be a little tricky. Yeah. I hope that goes okay. Yeah, I see people well, okay, have slightly different strats. Yeah, man, he gets it. Yeah. Uh, okay. Generally, that's the most nice. common strat that I see. Just uh, eat that caped Koopa and then just go for the jump slightly after. Yeah. Pretty, pretty straightforward. So okay, so Rogue Link is small for Red Ridge One. That's that. Can, I can see how that would be kind of scary for a newer player. Yeah. Uh, like, Def definitely Butterbridge oh, too as well. Oh wait, no, he has a Yoshi. I, I, I didn't I actually think he had a Yoshi. Yeah. It's not a, a Force of or Vanilla Fortress. Smartball decided to take it safe. I don't blame him though in a race environment. Yeah. Nope. Oh, takes damage there, but luckily you can get that courtesy much yeah. in there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. See if he tries to get to keep peace beads for all this. Ooh, he does. Okay, nice. Hm. Oh, has a little trouble with the door. Final boss. <laughs> yeah, he's having a little slip. Ooh, that was interesting. <sighs> that was a decent way to recover there. Yeah. So, since Smartball does not have a Fire Flower, he will be going for a trick called Cycle Skip, where basically if you jump on Ludwig before he actually touches the ground, it will actually just skip a cycle and he'll automatically be able to be stomped on again. Yeah, nice, you got it. Definitely not as fast as Flower, but it's definitely faster than just waiting it out. It's like the middle ground. Uh. <laughs> Wait, Rogueling lost, lost Yoshi apparently. Uh, oh yeah, it was not. Uh, huh. So that'll that so that could make that could make Butteridge too a little scary, especially he might just try to go back for a uh, Yoshi. Yeah, VS. Mm -hmm. I we've definitely seen two or three runners go back to VS two for a Yoshi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right, Smartball is still on a decently paced run. We'll have to see how it, how Force treats him. And I'm wondering yeah. if he'll go for the fast fire flower grab with a roulette block, as we've seen some other runners do. Uh. <laughs> Definitely will be something to pay attention to. Yeah. Looks like Rogue Link is trying to go for the level without Yoshi, but... Oh. To be expected, newer players definitely will not know the Yoshi strat, and it's very intimidating going through this level without any type of protection. Oh. Even just Smart having on. a mushroom. It's probably not getting a fire flower. Uh -huh. huh. Guessing he's just gonna try to rock it. Yeah. Try to go through. Okay. 
So Rogue Link doing kind of like non-PSP strats, but yeah, like any strat that doesn't tempt, doesn't make it out as a good one. <laughs> That's how I see it. Oh, okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. I thought he was going to fall there. <laughs> Me too. So small balls coming up to the first clip. To the, to the clip. Looks like see which one gets the Ooh. wall two or three times. Try to get that sub pixel. Seems like everyone has a slightly different strat. We'll see if this strat helps them. Guess it wasn't his favor. Ooh. Nice first try. <laughs> definitely considering the skill gap here, Rogue Link is definitely in a decent position. Ooh. Okay, he had a little trouble with the throw off there, but scary. grabbed it. Looks like Rook Link maybe going for. Oh, no, he's not. No. Okay, yeah. keeping P-Speed there. Like, I, I doubt they're trying to keep P-Speed, so I understand oh, yeah, sure. might it's not nice. keep it. Ooh, gets hit by the fish at the end there. Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm so. He may, I'm guessing he's. Would definitely so be smart to get big here. So there's a there's a mushroom in the bubble in the second half, and you also get one from the midpoint, so he can still like have power up in the inventory. Yeah, because you want to have at least a mushroom for Roy, so that you yeah. can do a deboost, which saves a decent chunk of time, because you don't have to wait through the entire snake. Yeah, you can do it without it one in inventory, but I personally think it's like easier if you have something in the inventory, because like it's kind of tight with the damage boost. Well, he doesn't go for that mushroom there. I'm assuming he's just going to go for the midway. That's definitely the easiest. Yeah. Yeah, there's one right there. Okay, he's not getting one in inventory. Hmm. Looks like Rogue Link has a 21-43. Oh. Don't. Ooh. Don't skip oh, time no. small here. Oh, no. Ooh, is he going... Oh, oh is he going to die? He's going to intentionally die. Yeah, that's probably the... Best idea. Yeah, uh, having like losing mushroom there is punishing. Yeah. yeah, it looks like he's just gonna go for that one. I don't blame him. Yeah, like I think I I like just just tried to go him back and getting it, but actually I think nine might. Might. Mm -hmm. But yeah, that part can be a little tricky if you don't like get the strat you want to get. Goomba Clip win, Twitch Master. <laughs> yeah, like it, like you can like clip through the 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 cement block with the Goomba if you do it correctly. You need would need to ask Rezzy about that though. Looks like Rogue Link is gonna go for the Fire Flower here at the beginning instead of the roulette block. Mm. Yeah, as long as Smart Ball does not get trolled by fireballs in any way, definitely will be able to just do the deboost here. Mm. Oh, he just barely got the, the star. I thought he was going to get the cape there. Oh, yeah. See, if, if he decides to go for the damage boost, okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, but he gets it. 15 more bonus for Rogue Link. Okay, so, so Smart Ball getting the damage boost there, nice. And yeah, the platform's despawning, and oh, the, tur the statue despawned too. That's probably the closest cape I've seen that wasn't actually a cape. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, so let's see what Rogue Link decides to do with the clips. Okay. Oh, he didn't try to set the sub-pixel. Okay, he's just not gonna go for it. Hmm. So... Let's see if, if Rogue Link decides to go for the clip, like, for the easy clip. Like, if you do the stage normally, ultimately, then the easy clip is actually slower, but I don't know. Like, I feel for new, like, for new runners, oh, if yeah, you just player. try to clip. Yeah. Yeah, you want to try to do the easy clip, but, yeah. Oh, losing Yoshi. I guess that's not too important if you're not... Okay, he's not even going to try to clip. Hmm. Yeah, if you lose Yoshi, I guess it might be slower to just eat, try to easy clip, because getting him back there would take a while. So, so Smart Ball heading to, to, to this level, to Chocolate Island 1. It can be a kind of hard level to do, no cape. So, let's see how it goes. Getting the Mushroom, that's probably a pretty good idea. Okay. Handling it well so far. 
Oh, taking damage there. Yeah. Hmm. Looks like he's still oh. gonna get through. Ooh, he does. Ooh, had a little trouble there. Ooh, uh, oh, oh, and he, didn't, he there's also no mid point if you don't take the pipes, so he'll have to start from the beginning. Oh, true. So that's that's a pretty big time loss. May give Rogue Link a bit of a chance to catch up. Oh, but Rogue Link is small though. Yeah. Ooh, he took the damage again after getting that mushroom. Let's see. Hmm. Huh. Uh, oh, looks like. So let's. Oh. Ooh. Whoa! What's he? No. He, he really little... wants to. Do, he really wants to to jump off that chuck. It can be kind of hard to do that. Yeah. Like. Yeah. If you're small, I mean, you need like... to be a little more precise. Yeah. If you have a but... power up, you're guaranteed pretty much. But if you're small, you need to really make sure you don't mess up there. Like. As someone with the 37, I usually, like, like, I usually use the P-Switch, just hop on it, and then just go through this, the blocks that appear from that, but that is slower, though. Okay, so, see a smart ball, try to get the, the spring ball mushroom here. Oh, not going for the mushroom. Uh, it just goes for the jump at the end. Yeah. Okay, so. It looks like Rogue Link is finally done with uh, Force Illusion 3 here, going to Roy. Yeah, this is this is still it's still decently close. <laughs> yeah, considering the gameplay from both downs and ups, it's been a decent race. Yeah. It's definitely one of the slightly more closer ones for sure. Yeah. Okay. Let's see, what Marvel does here. Ooh. Let's see, well, oh. he, goes, he just gets Suicide Door as well. Whoa, I'm nice. Yeah, he's just gonna get the power up here. You can also do a small backup strat, but that's definitely pretty risky for a race. So I don't, yeah. don't blame him for going for that. What's he? Ooh. Okay. Whoa, Ooh. what's he? He tried okay. to go for a little save me there. Does not so, get it. Okay, see what he decides to do. Ooh. Uh, he actually had that bounce there, but oh. he just didn't, he just didn't go up. Yeah, uh, that's really sad to see. It's yeah. just getting the bounce can be a little frustrating, but then if you actually get it and don't even get up there, that's that's just unfortunate. Ooh. Yeah. Looks like so, Smart Ball may be going on tilt a little here. You can do it, Smart Ball. Okay, so none of the things he spawned on Rogue Link's side. I usually don't see that. Yeah, it's pretty rare. Okay. See if if small ball's gonna go for the mushroom. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Recommend that. So goes for suicide so, door. Hmm. Yeah. Slanted. Looks like Rogue Link actually got a gold there, and he's ahead of PB again. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah, nice. <clears throat> Ooh, accidentally does not get through there. Oh. That cost him a little time, that was a little scary too. Oh. Looks like he's gonna land this room down pretty well. Ooh. Slope kind of. Oh, slopes. Yeah, slopes yeah. can be can be kind of bad. Yeah, I guess it's probably best to like jump off the Koopas there. But yeah. Uh, yeah, that room you can do a lot of different strats. It's more preference. Yeah, still not getting the Yoshi. I feel like I mean, the Yoshi makes this a little harder, actually. Yeah, yeah, I would get it, but I I feel like I'm in the minority with that. Yeah, most people here would probably say it's a lot easier for them, including me. Yeah. Because I've tried both, and I feel like Yoshi just adds more. Uh, yeah. Hm. Okay, he's got that time. Oh, two labs, though, on Smart Ball's end. Yeah, he needs to be a little careful here with the next few levels. Definitely yeah. until he gets to that Wendy save point. You should be a little careful here. Yeah. Oh, Yoshi throws, or, I see Yoshi, Smart Ball throws it up 
It's okay. Like fuzzy up instead of forwards. Okay, you got the mushroom. Good. Looks like he recovered okay. well. Looks like he just had a little See, mess up there. Okay, getting the midpoint, I would definitely recommend that in the tournament setting. Real so quick, let's see. CI1. We'll have to see how he chooses to go about the ghost hopes. Yeah. Smartball landing this pretty well after his little mess up in the beginning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. See if he can keep his P speed here. I've seen a few players who lose it halfway through and then they can't really gain it anymore. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Smartball is landing P speed here. Having no issues. Yeah. Ooh, had a little trouble with Chucks. Looks like this last oh, section will be a little slower. Yeah. I don't know. I, pref I honestly prefer not having P-Speed here. The slugs can be kind of annoying when you have P-Speed. For sure. Uh, Ooh, Rogue's so Orb Links. Ooh. Boot okay, did damage he... Boost. There was a little sketchy. Oh, okay. At least he got the damage boost. Yeah. Yeah. That was pretty close, though. Yeah. Uh. So... Let's see how... So, okay, Smart Ball's in. Wendy's Castle, th that can be... I think just pressing the reset button, Ben, but don't quote me on that. Is that the global timer? Oh, uh, yeah, not sure about that. We smart ball with the boost with the Crusher yeah. instead, which is a lot more riskier, but it still gets it. Yeah, okay, so... Roguelink just handling... Handling CI2 non pcb strats. I can un understand that. Get through that. But this part, it can be kind of... Okay, probably getting room two. I'm smart ball trying to go for the faster setup. Some of the racers I've yeah. seen that try to go for a somewhat fast room here in one D's go for the strat where you bounce off the hot head and you go back and forth slightly. It's yeah. two or three. It, I would say it's like a second or two slower, but definitely way more worth it in a race environment. It's worth. Yeah. Shout out to Rezzy for that strat. Yeah. So, when did Quebec can be? Kind of annoying, like, yeah. Okay, get it, gets it well. Good RNG. Oh, yeah. Smurfball having a nice windy finish there of 3156. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Let's see, so. It's. Uh, whoa. So. Rogelink getting through room one well, getting the midpoint. Let's see what he, what he decides to do here. At least Smart okay. now doesn't have to worry about his lives as much. Yeah, so he slot strats. <laughs> Definitely a safe and not horribly slow compared. I mean, it's a little slower, but definitely for a newer player, it's not like it's the end of the world. Yeah. I mean, I still do it sometimes if I have nothing else to do in this situation. Yeah. Doesn't get so, speed. Oh, oh Rogue Link. He, he could have the damage boost, but he wasn't in the right position for that. Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if uh, Smart Ball here can go for a Boomerang despawn here of some kind. Mm -hmm. Last night we had a double despawn. We'll see if we can get anything tonight. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, it looks like Smart Ball set up well for the scroll SD. I guess. I guess maybe he can also get the double if he does it. Yeah, he does get oh, okay, the Okay, nah. Does get the first despawn and he's gonna just take the damage boost, which is reasonable. Yeah. I don't know, the damage boost it's not too hard, but I guess it can be kinda scary in a way because like it's really punishing if you fail. Looks like Smartball here is gonna go for the backup mushroom, which I don't blame him in a race. Yeah. Only thing is it can make like uh Bob One can be kinda hard with uh, with the mushroom actually. Yeah. But it's it is an extra hit though, so and getting the safety star, don't blame him for that. And... Orb. 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 <laughs> Alright, we got one orb down. One orb oh, down. Rug Link. Rug Link with the death towards the, towards the midpoint. Uh... Yeah, Wendy's Castle is annoying. The mm. ship warbling. Uh. Uh. 
so. Okay, so I actually don't. Oh, okay. I don't actually like. It's kind of hard to get like a strike. Yeah, you just have pretty much have to take a damage boost, I think. Yeah. If That's your best way of going about it, is just trying to damage yourself during the beginning and just flow through the rest of it. If he goes, okay, not going for the midpoint. That jump isn't too bad, but I don't know. I guess it'd be a little stressful, but yeah. Okay. Okay, so we're going into the first half. See? Right. Oh, he's getting a mushroom. Yeah. I, I approve of that strat, but not many people would. In terms of the tournament races for the past two or three days, that's definitely actually that's actually been the preferred strat. Most people, oh. ooh, most people oh, I've blank. seen have gone for that courtesy block, which I guess me I definitely would see yeah. why in a race. Yeah, you you don't get hit. You're more likely to get hit, but you can just damage base. Yeah. Okay. Every so single opponent yesterday, in my knowledge, went for it. Yeah. At least the ones that I did. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, getting the, without getting hit. Ooh. Oh, Rogue Link taking another death, but yeah. Okay, now we have to see. Is he gonna go for it? Looks like he may be. Oh, okay. Oh, no. Uh, uh. Kinda yeah. goes back well, in the last second. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, he had four lives. Probably not gonna Ooh. play, but yeah. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Ooh. Had a little okay, mess up yeah, there. he's gonna made it. Yeah. Ooh, getting the dragon coin, huh? Wasn't expecting that. I guess you may as well. Hmm. Like, there's nothing to really do. So, let's see how Rogue Link handles Wendy. It can be kind of hard for... Like, newer players? Oh, missed the cycle. Ooh. So... Oh... Uh, okay. Nice! Ooh, he, he, almost hit, he, he almost hit the fireball, but got it. See if Spawnball can get this jump. No. Oh, okay. So you'd want to jump there, and if you do it correctly, I believe you have a three and five chance of getting yeah. to go over that. Yep. But if you just, you can like also just hold left, like, and hug the wall, but then you only have like a one and five, I think. Yeah, hugging the wall is not what you want to go for. I see some people go for it, but it's a lot less likely. Oh, he didn't. Like, he didn't have peace before. He still made it, though. Good. Looks like Smart Ball is going to try to keep his peace speed here. Oh, kind of loses yeah. it. You can definitely recover it here in between. And yep, oh. he does recover it. Ooh, well, oh, yeah. nice. Okay. That was a little close. Oh. Had just. Oh. Ooh. Looks like he's going to take that day. Ooh, and he dies. Ah. Uh, oh. He'll be fine. Like, he still has lives, but. Yeah, might should just come take it safely. Yeah, we're not blaming him for taking it safe now. Generally, I don't like him like taking it safely in this. Like, if he, he like a lot of players, even really good players, can kind of like lose several lives here, and he doesn't have too many lives left. Yeah. <laughs> So, it seems like he's just aiming safely, yeah, definitely. They don't play more. Yeah. So, like the, the thing about being small is that, like, Reznor, if he gives you a bad pattern, it can be really bad to try for the fast one. Ooh, looks like Ooh. he did get a good one. That was really close. Oh. There were two really close calls there. And you notice, like, he, he touched the left half of the platform. It seems like when you do that, you just play up and... Yeah. It didn't, it wasn't bad in that scenario, but yeah, I think that's if you hit the left pl half of the platform. I guess it can be essentially bad if you hit it, do it lighter, but there it wasn't too bad. Yeah, if you do it early enough, it's no issue. Yeah. So, oh, let's see what he's doing. Okay, Rogue Link going for the safety star. I'm about to have another orb. And Smart Ball here should be able to just get right over a 41 minute time as long as he doesn't mess up Bowser. Yeah. Okay. Orb. Orb. Alrighty here. Both these runners both towards the end here. Definitely considering the skill gap, this was definitely a bit closer than some may have expected. Yeah, let's see how Rogue Link's done compared to PB. Okay, 49 seconds ahead. Looks like... Uh, I don't know. 
He can, st yeah, he can still PB roguelike. Oh yeah, he still has time so Yeah. Uh. It depends what strats he has though. Yeah. Oh, taking damage there. Okay, that doesn't. Oh, he doesn't go for the spray. <laughs> I was scared about the spooky fire. <sighs> okay. Roll link taking the safety block and see if he gets lost up. What block it does. Okay, got it, good. Oh, oh. Chrome, please. I want to open that in a separate page. Huh? I want to actually do that. Uh. Uh. Ooh. Ooh, Smurf mm -hmm. Ball takes a hit there. Looks like he's just gonna uh. get the mushroom anyways. Yeah. Does Smurf Ball want to join the call after his rip? Uh, oh. yeah, if, uh, if he wants to, he for sure can. Okay. Uh... Ooh. Roll coin there. Oh, ooh, Smart Ball not getting that. Hopefully it goes okay. Coin race bot, Smart Ball just finished with a 4120, so that will be his time <laughs> enter. Yeah, 4120. Congrats. Okay. Yeah. Uh, um, and if we can, in a little here, we'll see if we can get Smart Ball here. Check, I'm checking that right now. I think it may be smart to hold off slightly until we can see Road Link finish if Smart Ball can wait around for a few minutes. Oh, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Because that's uh. what we, that would be preferred if we could wait until the next racer is done instead of oh, casting. Oh, something. yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right, yeah. <laughs> that just always Swedish elbow. Oh yeah, there's an Akisto race today at 4 p.m. Yeah, and that will be versus Milnium, and that's 9 p.m. GMT, and as uh, Pat just mentioned there, uh, 4 p.m. Eastern time. And uh, apparently, Milnium's been working pretty hard, so it'll be interesting to see what he pulls out of the bag. And then at 9 p.m. today, we have Tina Hacks versus Zero Maverick. We'll have to see how that goes. Yeah. Oh, that's going to be a good race. I am actually really looking forward. It's possible I'll be facing, I think, the loser of it. If I lose against Aaron, I'll actually be facing the loser of that match. Yeah, I know. It looks if... like we're going to have one of the first uh, round two races of Garbanzo here. Yeah. If I lose th if I lose this and GDF knocks out a Keisto, I'll probably be facing him in the losers bracket. So it'll be interesting to see what happens. Because I'm oh. versus Seathor. Yeah. So okay. after today, we're gonna be having all round two matches because uh, round one is finishing Ooh. up here, starting today. It's done. Yeah. So, so Tina okay. Hacks one will be like the last one tonight. Around one. So yeah, we'll like we're we're gonna wait for Rogue Link to finish before doing the interview. Uh, we don't know completely about Panga and Carl. I know there were complications between one of them, but uh, you, um, you're not the I'm not the right check. person to ask. I know other people will probably have better responses. Carl and I were talking. Let me check uh, our messages. Uh, he basically said uh, Kaizu 3 ended up eating all of his time. Like, he's putting a lot of time into that at the minute. Whoa, so, whoa, cool. nice. Nice, nice. Farball. So are they... So they're, they're not doing the race? Uh, basically, it seems unlikely. Because uh, I think even last night, he was playing Kaizu on stream. I, I can't remember. I was, like, busy, but... Um, yeah, he had said it, it took up most of his time this week. And uh, the videos as well, like, take a lot of work. But, I, I don't know, uh, since the deadline is in about 17 hours, or no, no, actually less, 12 hours. Yeah, 12 basically, hours. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, 
Um, it seems very unlikely. So I'm sad about that, but uh, you know, and it's I'll, funny because Dodds intentionally it. rigged the seeding just to have it. Um, uh, I thought he was joking about that. Maybe, no, maybe that's not. actually true. Oh, okay. Oh, well. I, so... I was hoping that if it wasn't rigged, I could be possibly against Carl Sagan. Like, be pretty cool. But, yeah, that would have been a superstar race. Alright, so we have a uh, rogue link here getting through battle yeah. right now. Yeah, he, he can actually PB. They can actually PB if, if they do well here. Oh, they have a lot of time, so ooh, knocks out the Koopa. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think a lot of uh, trouble here in battles right now. Yeah, yeah, it can be kind of hard. When you're a new player to do this battle, yeah. <laughs> oh, whoa. Okay, I guess that. Oh, he got the Mecha Koopa skip. <laughs> oh. That's not the skip you want to get. Yeah, Carl's been playing a lot of Kaizo lately in general. And Mario Maker, so. <laughs> so, okay, he hasn't much people though for this. I don't imagine he'll go for Ball Skip. <laughs> Whoa! No, no. Okay. <laughs> Oh, he wants to make a Koopa. He wants to make a Koopa. Let's hopefully see if he can only get two balls here instead of four. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. One hit. Nice. You guess it, yeah. Okay. So if it goes well, that can be about like a minute, actually. That'd be that'd be cool. Okay. Pretty good. And they still have both their power ups. It's okay, just waiting on the hints. There's gonna be a giant PB here. Well, oh, lost both, uh, lost both of them. Don't panic. Okay, right just. There. Oh! One hit! Hey, that's one. Oh no. Ooh. Okay. Sure. Okay, so just. Yo! And he gets it. <sighs> 4809 according to race bot here. Yo, that minute PB. Congratulations. Yo. What was his PB? His pre previous uh previous one was a 49 looks like 4955 think, according to his split. GG. Very well done. Nice. Yeah, but he just PB'd by about a minute. My or something. Is kind of tolerable now. <laughs> okay. Um then let's get Smartball in here. Yo, Smartball. Congrats. Very well done. Thank you very much. Yeah, congrats. Yeah, that was a cool race. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that wasn't my best effort. <laughs> oh, well, you still did enough uh, to get through, and uh, it wasn't that bad, really. Uh, you you kind of redeemed it at the end, and uh, thought we slip up in... Uh, Volley Fort. Yeah, yeah. I I don't really have the P speed strats learned in Valley Fort, but I tried them anyways and well Yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've I've as well I've also tried them uh with a because they don't look that hard, but if you haven't learned them then it's gonna be tricky. Especially yeah. in a race. Right. Yeah, uh, oh, we've got Rooglink in uh, race one. Let's bring him over. Hey, Yo, Rooglink, Yo. congrats on the PV. Hey, yeah. Rogue, congrats. Thanks. Uh, I muted my stream audio so that you wouldn't have the Discord and the... Yeah. <laughs> but thanks for the GG on PB. Like, that would have been so much better if I didn't just 
keep panicking on Wendy. Uh, that level can be tricky. Yeah, well, it was, um... It went fine in practice this morning, but I kept choking on that giant spark. And yeah. And over-adjusting. But still a, still a PB. I got, um... My Chaco ghost house was incredible, though. I got suicide door and everything. Yeah, that was uh, that was really really clutch. And uh, <laughs> as well for your seed, uh, you were doing some really really good strats. Uh, I was I was impressed uh, by some of the things you were doing. So well done there. And Thank it's you. pretty clear to me that you could get a low forty time and probably sub forty quite soon. Yeah, I like yeah, that VS three so too. I like that VS VS three for the end. That was that was really that was good. Yeah, your nice. VS. Yeah, it stood out to me. Your VS three. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna rewatch it with the uh, with the commentary. Plus, oh, yeah. the, inc the incredibly close star that was almost a cape. That really that scared me. So <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it. <laughs> that was that was frames away from just going straight into that pit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, but it's definitely a good thing to to rewatch it with commentary, and the commentary for this race was really good too. So. Shout out to Garbanzo and uh, Patrick. And Pat for the as well. Pat for the the restream as well. <laughs> Still waking up. <laughs> <laughs> so I just got out of bed for this. Uh, but yeah, yeah. Smartball. Who is your opponent in round two? Uh, I don't know. I it'd be mostly uh, it's mostly SMW. SMW. If he won. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. that's a really close one. That is going to be a really Close race. Um, it's very hard for me to call. Better than I did today, though. That's for sure. <laughs> Hopefully. Well, earlier um, you were glad to get sub fifty, so forty one's not too bad. This is true. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah I, hadn't, I haven't played in well over a week. I've been uh, helping my girlfriend move across the country. Mm. All right. mm. but, um. Yeah. Uh, Rook, you will be facing. Uh, sorry, this is a lot of scrolling. Oh, you're fine. <laughs> uh, Twenty-five. Yep, the losers brackets at the bottom. You don't have to remind me. <laughs> <laughs> you will be facing Lol DBZ, and in their race, they oh. I think they might have forfeited. I'm not sure. I can't remember actually. Sorry, in their race they got a 44-27, and yeah, you could definitely get your time down to that area. Oh, I think it's so too. Good. With how capable yeah, you were in levels like ball. vanilla, like VS3 and Ghost House, that definitely shows that you can definitely learn some other strats yeah, as well. They were very good. Yeah, and I definitely started working on some harder strats for sure. It was just a matter of which ones I wanted to try to do for the race or not do for the race. Because consistency. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, understandable. But I'm not going to argue with a PB and a one and a half minute gold on Valley of Bowser. <laughs> yeah, it was good. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thanks guys for uh, thanks everyone for coming together. A very nice race, Smartball and Rogue Link here, both very good runs from both of them. Uh, Thank you all for the commentary and research. Yeah, thanks for the race uh, and the commentary. So uh, later yeah. today we have Millennium versus.